congratulations on your purchase of a Digmaster 4000. Caution. Forget the instructions. I've dug thousands of fire pits. <laughs> I meant to do that. <laughs> this is going to be the best beast feast in Lake Bottom history. Ow! Ow! When the warmest. I can't wait to celebrate Beast Feast. Beast Feast is awesome. I love Beast Feast. What's Beast Feast? You don't know what Beast Feast is? I, uh, tell him, Gretch. Mm, you got me, Arma. Uh. The origin of Beast Feast. Uh, well, the legend is long and clouded in the mists of time. Right. You don't know either. Who cares? More firewood! <laughs> You call this stack and wood? Ooh, a talking log! <laughs> can we keep him? Can we keep him, please? Can, can I knit him a hat? Can I knit him a rocket? Hi, I'm McGee. This is Gretchen. That's Squirt Sawyer and I'm on. Oh, Greetings! <laughs> I knit you socks for hey. your old man feet! I ain't deaf, you squeaker. Sorry you were almost kindling. Back when I was a bottom dweller, we got used for firewood pretty much every day, and no one complained. You were a bottom dweller? That's right. Who's the name? I got Lake Bottom deep in my bones, along with the rheumatiz. These bones could use a hand out of this fire pit. Looks like you young'uns are prepping for Beast Feast. Oh, those were the good old days. You were at an actual Beast Feast before? Awesome! Yep, back in the day it was B-Y-O-B-B. -B. Bring your own beast buddy. This year's me and Lou. Except my old buddy Lou's been missing for years. Hmm. We'll help you find him, right, guys? Sure we can. Squirt here is a regular bloodhound. <laughs> <laughs> help from two kids and an awkward dog boy? That'll be the day. Like the, hey, let go! Go, dang, finds! <sighs> Guess today is the day. Hey! <laughs> Thanks for the help, little lady. Anytime. What do you say we help you find Lou now? Oh, this here collar used to belong to Lou. You think your awkward dog boy can trap this? <laughs> You betcha. Find the scent. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Good boy. Oh. <laughs> We're coming for you, Lou. <laughs> well, brush my dentures. You found our old sleeping quarters. Uh, it's not much of a cabin, is it? In my day, we didn't need no fancy cabins, and no one complained. Wait, we all complained. But no one complained about the complaining. It smells like burnt toast. All I'm getting is pure lake bottom history. Oh, wait, and some dirty undies. Uh, the undies is me. History? What's with the burn marks? Those must have been on account of Lou. That's a sure sign he's been here. He always was the rowdy one. <laughs> oh, it sounds like you guys had a blast. Oh, you got something, boy? <laughs> Come on, campers. Hey, two for two. Good boy. <laughs> you found our old watering hole. It ain't changed a bit. Oh, pretty oh, awesome. As long as you don't breathe stinky goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Lou used to do the same thing. <laughs> Look here. Those are fresh burn marks. Lou must have been here, too. This was our leaping hot lizard rock. Your leaping hot what? Our leaping hot lizard rock. See? Of course, I forgot how to swim. <laughs> Old man overboard! <laughs> God, sorry, I didn't ask for no help. I asked for. Uh, uh, was it oatmeal? <laughs> <laughs> I suppose if I did ask for help, I should probably say thanks. Ah, forget about it. We're all bottom dwellers, right? Why don't we get you back to the fire to warm up? Warm up? We're already hot on Lou's trail. Come on, Sniffer. <laughs> That's the spirit. No stop until we find Lou. Are you sure this is the right way? Your hound sure knows his nose. If I'm not mistaken, just up this here hill is where I first found Lou. Ah, just sit back yeah. and enjoy the ride. Hey, does anybody want to sing a camp song? That ain't a bad idea. Bottom dwellers, take the cake. Do da, do da. Don't poke your toe in the toxic lake. Oh, do da, da. Built 
thin airbag saved me from that fall. Anytime. <gasps> and you found the spot where we used to play for hours. Let me guess, Lou burnt it. <laughs> Come on, Bo, try for old time's sake. Well, I suppose so. <laughs> <laughs> Kids, <laughs> I haven't had this much fun since the old days with Lou. I'm oh, sorry we couldn't find your best beast buddy for you. I appreciate it, but I found some new best friends at least. <laughs> That's the lake bottom spear. <laughs> oh. What was that? I forgot I had this. Lou's favorite toy. Come on, Bo. You're officially our guest at Beast Feast. Yeah! Good news, guys. Poe's joining us for Beast Feast. Perfect timing. Ten seconds to midnight and we just finished the fire pit. Anybody got a match? Thanks for having me, kids. But I sure do wish Lou was here. Aw, oh, don't be down, Poe. Lou's here in spirit. Here's to friends old and new. And the best Beast Feast ever. <laughs> Shut my gob! Lou sure got big! That's Lou! Easy, boy. Easy! Uh-oh. I feel so exposed. No, 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 not mine! Yours! <laughs> Squirt, what are you doing? Sorry, I kind of got caught in the woods! Right! Go right! I think we lost him. <laughs> Exceedingly good at this. Run, Squirt, that's the squeaky. You've got to be kidding me. Campers, we tried. That's okay. Mom always said it would end like this. <laughs> Lou, you silly beast. <laughs> Playing a little rough with our friends, ain't you? <laughs> Don't you remember me, Lou? It's me, Poe. Oh. <laughs> oh, I miss you too, old best buddy, old pal. <laughs> you kids okay? Oh, Lou can get a little rowdy. Uh, we love rowdy. <laughs> Thanks for saving us. <laughs> That's what friends are for. Now, what do you say we kick this here Beast Feast bonfire into overdrive? The problem is, we still need a match. <laughs> well, you got Lou. You don't need any matches. Right, Lou? <laughs> Bite. I'm already planning for next year's Bring Your Own Best Beast Feast. I'm going to bring a frogalope. Oh, I'm going to bring a catapus. Oh, and I'm going to wrangle me an alopotamus. <laughs> I hope you and Lou can join us next year. You got it. Thanks for having us. Later, friends. Now, let's get you home, Lou. 
to the best beast feast ever! Oh, 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 oh. See you next year! Wait, Lou, you forgot your squeaky! Squirt! No! no. Once, a stranger wandered this barren land, searching for a legendary camp. <sighs> I'd recognize those Toad Squad tracks anywhere! <laughs> you bottom feeders gotta learn! Get out steel from Junk Queen Susie! It's just a toaster! Even us rebels need a crunchy bagel once in a while! <laughs> Junkiness. You know who is coming for she knows why. I will have my revenge! Smooth. You okay, kid? Hey, where'd he go? Oh, you Susie spy! Ha! You fell for the old <coughs> hide in the <coughs> fan trick, which is a really bad trick. <coughs> <laughs> oh, it's like impossible to breathe down there. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, oh, easy. We bottom rebels gotta stick together. We bottom rebels? <gasps> the secret bottom rebel handshake. How do you know that? Who do you think invented it? Y you mean you're a stranger? <laughs> really? Then I suppose you know the legend. I don't just know it. I lived it. Long ago, I found the ancient compass that legend foretold would lead to a long-lost camp paradise. But then my pain-in-the-butt sister stole it from me. Mostly because she likes shiny things. Susie! Hmm. Short legend. Good news is, I've got a plan. This plan of yours, is it dangerous, foolhardy, and only 8% likely to succeed? 8% is kind of high, but sure. But only because we need to save our pals. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. That's nice. To the left. Lower. Oh, that's sensitive right now. Oh, what? Oh! How dare you sit on my throne after your total epic fail? Uh, epic, yes, but not total, oh, junky one. Check this out. Give me that. Dear Suze, you're evil from your head to your shoes. I'm coming to get yous. And also my compass. Love your worst nightmare and delightful brother, McStranger! You had my baby brub in your clutches and let him get away! He's your brub? You don't even look alike! He's got pooey brown hair and a little peanut nose. You're more of an albino rat blonde. Silence! Or I'll throw you in the bottom dome to fight Domehead! No! Anything but that! <laughs> Ah, oh, man, that squatch is on the fritz again. No, oh, water. Oh, please, water. Or oh, perhaps a nice tea with a sprig of mint? Keep jogging, squatch face, or I'll serve you up with mint. Oh, yes, your belligerence. Your screech is my command. Come on, Toad Squat. I've got a little surprise for my brub brub. Ooh, what kind of surprise? Should I wear something more festive? <laughs> ah! You sure this plan will work? 
Sure it's gonna work. He's mixed stranger. Relax, I thought of everything. Oh, except for the part where I told Susie I was coming. <laughs> Relax, I thought of everything. Well, thanks for trying, Rebels. <laughs> <laughs> this way, McLean Brain. <laughs> You got the best seat in the house. Oh, cool, Toadface. What's the show? You. So make it good, Mick about to be Mick squashed. A oh, big deal. It's just an awesome jungle gym. <laughs> With a vicious rebel smashing monster inside it. <laughs> Let the brother stomping begin. That means you, Bull Brain. <laughs> Thanks for cutting me a break, sis. Ugh, you useless oaf. Attack! Hey, dummy! Better get in the swing of things! <laughs> oh, man. Swing of things. What's with the giggling bucket brain? Get with the smashing! Oh, for once Toad Squad's right. What are you waiting for, you hunk of junk? Finish it! Yeah. We'll see who finishes who! Once I stop seeing two of everything. You can do it, Mick Stranger! I have an explicable blind faith in you, despite only knowing you for an hour or so. <laughs> And I've never looked trimmer. Glad to have you back, Squatchman. Now let's hit the road, bottom rebels. You coming, Mick Stranger? Yep. Just a few loose ends to tie up. Say bye bye to your compass thingy, brub brub. Smell you later. Ow, Pinchy! I'll meet you at the gate. Okay, but. No one escapes Camp Sunny Spears! <laughs> Too late! We'll never make it! Oh, you're trapped now, Bottom Rebel. Huh? Yeah. Sorry, Suze! Bottom Rebels don't do traps! Hey! Hay is for horses, and that compass is mine! <laughs> Florin Gretch! That door won't hold forever! Thank you, Mick Stranger! 
Put your pedal to the metal! You and your grody friends aren't going anywhere! <laughs> they don't make robot arms like they used to! Not on my watch! <laughs> And that was the last they ever saw of Big Stranger. Oh, looks like your camp is under new management. I'm telling Mom! Thanks to his sacrifice, the Bottom Rebels found their way to the lost paradise. Camp Lake Bottom. The end. You swimming or what? Coming! That's one of the lakes of Rotten Toad's one! not? Squirt, tell Gretchen what we're playing. We were playing something? I can't take it anymore. We've been playing cards so long, we're losing our minds. I'd do anything to end this boredom. What else can we do? It's raining. Weird. Who could that be? Weirder. We don't have a doorbell. Step right up, behold mystical treasures, wondrous wonders, and reasonable prices. <laughs> Everything about this is creepy and strange. Uh, I'm hearing not boring. That's right. Take a good gander. Ooh, pretty. Eyeballs make lovely jewelry, don't they? <laughs> ah! Nice! A butt scratcher! Uh, that's a genuine dragon's claw. Oh. Hey, you scratch it, you buy it. I'll take it. Why is a chewed up ratty old pencil like this in a velvet display case? No reason. It's just a boring old magic pencil. You wouldn't want it. Sure I would. You couldn't afford it. Sure I could. Oh, wait. I can't. I suppose I could accept a trade. All I have on me is this haunted mariachi cactus. Better buy this magic eraser, too. But no trades this time. Maybe your friends can chip in? What do you think I am, a chump? Besides, I never make mistakes. Oh, you'll make mistakes. They all make mistakes. <laughs> <laughs> what a nice guy. Ah. Okay, let's see what this baby can do. What's that, a volcano? No. It's a flying shoe monster! Huh? <laughs> My socks! <laughs> Do you know what this means? I'm gonna need more socks? No, well, yes, but that pencil is really magic. You might be right. Guys, let's get creative.
draw the biggest, awesomest thing ever. A kitten? What? Who doesn't love kittens? No, it's time we use this pencil to do some good in the world. Play pranks on Camp Sunny Smiles? Bingo. Ah, we'll never get there in this rain. You're right. No prob. I'll draw us a helicopter. Can it have kittens? Ah, oh, fine. I'll make it a kitten copter. Any requests, Scratch? Yeah, a unicorn. Okay, one unicorn horned kitten copter coming up. I was kidding. I don't even like unicorns. A masterpiece. <laughs> He's already cabin trained. <laughs> <laughs> Odd, the weather didn't call for hairballs. I suppose you're responsible for this sticky situation. In a word, meow? That raises more questions than answers. Um, did anyone lose a cat and or helicopter? Oh, Dad, you know some kids' imaginations <laughs> and magic pencils. And by some kid, he means him. I knew it was you. Oh. <laughs> now, now, pets are always a bigger responsibility than you think. The important thing now is to get it on a leash. Wait, pets? I know how to get this thing under control. We gotta go back for the pencil. With Mr. Kitty Copter on the rampage? No way! Oh, it just wants to play. Or maybe eat us. Oh, fine. I distract with Fishy Snack. You run bye-bye. Instead of asking why you keep fish heads in your hair, I'm just gonna say thanks. Here, here, kitty cat thing. Oh! Now! Well, I guess you won't be complaining about my hairballs anymore. Hey, stop that! Is that weird or adorable? Weird orable? Guys, focus! We have a ferocious monster on our hands. The only thing that can stop it is an even more ferocious monster. What? The best thing to take down a kitty copter would be a doggy fighter jet. It's perfect. Oh, can it be a stealth beagle? No, no, a hairier terrier. Wait, we have a monster on the loose and your plan is to make more? Eh, pretty much. Also, you might want to hit the deck. Whoa! Rough takeoff! Get it? Hilarious. That face really calmed you down. Uh, baby, it'll be a good kitty copter. <laughs> <laughs> Great! Now they're gonna destroy the whole camp. Nice going. Well, if you have a better idea, I'd like to hear it. Why don't we just find that sales freak and buy the magic eraser? Yep, that's a better idea. Fine, I'll go find him. You guys stay here and, I don't know, draw a giant leash or something. We might need it if I can't find him. Giant leash? And then what? Take the jet and helicopter for a walk? Yay! I love pet sitting! <sighs> Freaky, big, meow, rough destruction! I need that eraser. What eraser? The magic one! This old thing? I don't know. Maybe if you said please. Okay, can I please have it? Hmm. Nope, didn't work. But lives are at stake! Assuming my friends are still alive. Okay, okay, but it'll be very expensive. Gee, all I have to trade is this. What a marvelous looking contraption! No, 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 not so fast. I want to know what this does first. Ah, uh, not much. It kind of sucks. <laughs> Sorry, you use it, you buy it. I'd lend you my eraser, but I kind of need it. I got the eraser! What's going on? Well, they were destroying the entire camp in a fierce battle. Then they sort of forgot about it. Now the jet's getting a drink and the copter's cleaning itself. 
I don't know what's weirder, these hybrid monsters or the way cats and dogs think. Okay, here's the plan. I'm gonna bait the jet over here with some dog food. Once it's distracted, one of us has to charge in and erase it. <sighs> I'm guessing that'll be me. Uh, dog thing want din din? Wow. What? No, helicopter! That's jet food! Uh-oh, I'm feeling more carnage coming on. I got this, I think. Uh, here, boy, want to get the stick? Uh. Ah! Wow, I can't believe that worked. Eh, I knew it would. <laughs> this is almost too easy. Yep. Almost. Red! Ah! 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 Huh? Ah! Now that's how you clean up after your pets. Yay! <sighs> Time to lock these away. Phew! I'm coloring inside the lines from now on. I already miss Kitty's fur balls. I'm just glad we erased all the loose ends. Oh, hello! You're looking sandy. What have you been up to? <laughs> to the next camp. It's not what anyone expected, but Rosebud's got the sweet tooth. <laughs> What's me to hissing? <laughs> Cookies. Yes, please. Uh, They're not ready. The legend of the ancient cookie recipe clearly says, bake for 30 minutes. 30 minutes? Do you know how long that is? <sighs> Fine. I'll wait. <laughs> There was something I was supposed to be doing. Hmm. I said give it back, you furry bag of acorn stink! Oh, where is Squirt? Oh, can I eat them now? Eat some now? But they're still raw? Are you cracked in the skull? No! You'll get the worms. They do look pretty juicy. Now. The cookies will be ready for the chow down when this makes me the ding a ling ding. Und ding. Remember, 30 minutes. <sighs> or. Worms. thought about it, and we're all for forgiving you for the whole leaving us hanging thing. Right, Gretch? <laughs> there she! 
Besides, forgiving pals is what us real pals do. And nothing ever comes between us real pals. Nothing will ever come between us. about Squirt today, but I can't quite put my finger on what it could be. Ah, oh, Squirt, are those worms? Please tell me you're going fishing. <laughs> there, there. Uh, Ixnay on the ishing thing? I'm a papa, guys. Worm brood, meet my best pals. Guys, meet worm brood. Congratulations, papa. Quick, make them do something else. Oh, make them do something? Cornelius finds your anti-worm views offensive. My precious babies aren't here to entertain you. Parasitic belly button worms are people too. Uh, no, they're not. They're worms. Whatever. We are out of here. Come on, guys. Let's slither away angrily. Wait, how? Oh, 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 was I too hard on them? It's not their fault that they don't get my new worm responsibilities. I'm a family man now. Right, Cornelius? Don't waste another minute on those... those humans, Papa. <sighs> Besides, worms can do much more than mere humans. Please, our Papa, with sustenance. <laughs> what humans were we talking about again? <laughs> hey! That's how me and Squirt share milkshakes. What? Squirt likes backwash. That's how me and Squirt said we'd ride a worm canoe. You know, if we had a worm canoe. That's our grub, grubs! Hey, that's the way me and Squirt. Uh, I. No, I got nothing for that one. Open up! Hold on, McGee. Only 9,998 of my babies still need to go. Be patient. <laughs> Squirt, I didn't want to bring this up, but you've been spending a lot of time with your worms lately. <sighs> You're right, McGee. No one ever told me how hard it is to be a papa or to toilet train worms. No, they never do, pal. They never do. But hey, if you learned anything today, it's this very important lesson. Dudes before broods. So you're telling me to abandon my babies for you? How selfish! If you'll excuse me, I have some responsibilities to get back to! Oh, good job. Now that's how you use a potty. I hope you're listening, McGee! Uh, this whole brood thing is getting totally out of hand. We have to do something to remind Squirt that he can't choose those worms over us. What setting do you think works better on worm smoothies? Liquify? Ooh, disintegrate. <gasps> Atomize. Hmm. How about we just go and talk to Squirt this time? Fine, but no backwash sharing. Squirt, I'm really sorry about what I said before. So why don't all of us, including the worms, hang out and have some fun together? Sorry, McGee, but as you can see, the worms need their papa. Oh, come on. These worms look like they need some real fun, huh? Hey, check this out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that wasn't 
as much fun as wrestling with the mutant chipmunk, but... Cornelius thinks you're incredibly cruel, and your attempts at fun are totally lame. And I agree. Okay, that's it. Time to blend me up a worm fruit smoothie. Oh, scaring innocent worm babies, Gretch? I can see McGee doing that, but you? For shame! For shame! Come on, kids! We're leaving! <laughs> oh, wait! Come back, Squirt! Come back! <laughs> Worms! That's not polite! Stop it! Stop it right now! Don't make me come over there! I'm counting to three! One! Two! Two and a half! Three! Yeah. Squirt! Remember, dudes before brutes! Forever! No, oh, that's it! You're making me come over there now! I think I made a big mistake here! Don't be silly, Papa. Soon all of your worries will depart. Once we feed on your delicious brain, you won't be able to worry again. Phew! I love not worrying. Wait, what? Surely you know worm broods always feed on their papa. And it is their papa's duty to be fed upon. Ah! 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 I cannot believe that worked! <laughs> So did not. Did too! Double brood stamped it! <laughs> I'm gonna miss you guys! Sorry about your battling broods. You are right, McGee! Nothing should have ever come between us! Why don't we just pretend today never happened and just start over? <laughs> Squirt, no! <laughs> hmm. Ah, nothing like a fresh start. <laughs> Hey, I wonder if things will turn out any differently. Ending detour. When Squirt ate the compass. Uh, for the record, it did look like a cookie. Tasted like one, too. Cheer up, campers. We're just taking the excruciatingly long, unbelievably exhausting, totally incorrect way home. I know what'll crush this boredom. An insanely scary original story from the vault of the Terrameister Magee. Uh, please, no. I didn't pack spare undies. In fact, I didn't wear undies. And now I know something I'll never unknow. Once there was a creepy cabin. Built on an ancient burial ground. Very original, Terror Meister. Ha! A zombie's bearings are never wrong. Camp's right over. Oh, dang. Wrong again. Creepy cabin out of nowhere? Hey, it looks like we hit the haunted spook pot. How much you want to bet there's a gruesome caretaker? I don't want to find out! Uh -huh. I do! Let's see how high this place rates on the scarometer. <laughs> Hello! I'm Mr. Angler, the caretaker of this cabin. Did I call that or what? Um, hey there! We're from Camp Lake Bottom and we're kind of lost. You're welcome to spend the night. <sighs> creepy on the inside, creepy on the outside, and I'm the screamy filling in the middle? Sheesh, talk about laying it on thick. Oh, just what 
what the Chairmeister ordered. Uh, hey, where'd Angler go? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, a creepy painting with shifty eyes? <laughs> Classic. <laughs> let me out! Let me out! Let me out! I, uh, I knew I should have brought undies. Look on the bright side, Squirt. We may be dead by dawn, but we've got a scarific night ahead of us. That's the bright side? <laughs> Just remember the old haunted cabin rule. Don't split up. Sawyer? Uh, anyone notice we're down one zombie? Bonus! We get to go find him by exploring the creepy haunted cabin. Uh, or we could stay put and scream. <laughs> or... Abandoned cabin, peeping painting, sinister yet endearing caretaker. It's like lame horror bingo. Too bad there's nothing scary here like chipmunks. Okay, not funny, McGee. How'd you like it if this place was full of spiders? Now, spiders are gross, but scary? <laughs> Meh. Then how about insane clown? Nope. Hook handed killers? Double nope. Evil diaries that foretell doom? Nice try. Wait, evil diaries are a thing? I think I found my new worst fear. Lights out, squirt. Ah! Wait, wait up, guys! Guys! <laughs> guys! <laughs> Hello, harmless ball of light. <laughs> oh, wh wh where am I? Our little squirt followed the ghost light to the evil diary of doom. Ah! It's a thing! It's a thing! Oh. Ah! <laughs> Your fear is delicious. <laughs> Jam. Yuck. Rusty tricycles. Juvenile. Belly buttons. Got them. Wombats. Need them. Stale waffles. <gasps> Do not go there! What? You're afraid of waffles? Thanks, Gretchen. Now, what does our scare testament win? A one way ticket to. <gasps> oh, a secret room. Don't you have anything original? Well, I picked up this new wallpaper just for you. <gasps> I can't get enough. <laughs> What's the matter, Gretch? Stumped for ID. Gretch? Squirt? Nice try. Ooh, the horror cliches keep coming. Oh, an ancient burial ground in an attic? Sweet twist. Oh, for me? Oh, you shouldn't have. Just keeping it warm for you, along with this plate of waffles. W waffles? Yeah, as if. Station <laughs> angler, I'm a hundred percent scareproof. <laughs> Not for long. Now, boys, down. The cabin was built under an ancient burial ground. Um, uh, I, I know it's a no-no, but I just read somebody's diary. The campers knew they would never leave the house. Alive! And I was ambushed by wall-to-wall -wall chipmunks! Take that foot to wall! Oh, give me those lightweights. Haunted horror handled. You're welcome. Good, good, goody. Now, now let's do the one thing no one ever does in a haunted house. Get out! Like it. Except we've got to find Sawyer. Cool! Another chance to explore. This place has more horror cliches than an all-night screamathon. Look, you may not be afraid of anything, but we are. <laughs> McWaffle. Well, hey, I warned you. You dropped the waffle stuff. Why? Were you scared by a waffle when you were a kid or something? Well. Just forget waffles. You've lost your marbles. <laughs> At last, I've sniffed out your fear. <laughs> so I've ordered you a happy squeal of it to go. <laughs> Bippy! It's Wafflehead Waldo, the Waffle Burger mascot! <laughs> Giant, sticky. <laughs> no way. Your biggest fear is the Waffle Burger mascot guy? 
Yeah, he's on in my nightmare since I was a kid. One waffle delish kids meal, please. Coming up. Waffles? <laughs> yum, yum. <laughs> Your fear is the most delicious of all. <laughs> yum, yum. Ah! Waffle and Waldo! <laughs> That's right. A screamy part of any balanced meal. Personally, I find this combination of toasty waffle crunch and chewy hamburger center irresistible. Okay, back off! If anyone's gonna taunt McGee with his fears, it's gonna be us! In that case, I'll throw you to a bone. <laughs> 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 This camper buffet angler, zombie style. Oh! It's, it's good to see a friendly rotting face. Sorry I was gone so long. That chair's bigger than it looks. <gasps> Sawyer, protect me from Waffle and Waldo. <laughs> He's joking, right? Long story. <laughs> hey, if you want McGee, you gotta go through us. What a delicious idea. No more, Mr. Nice Waffle. It's feeding time. <laughs> yeah! Hey for higher ground! Yeah, grab hold, campers! <laughs> this would be a good time for a totally implausible yet inexplicably successful plan from Mickey! Cat! Face! The waffle! <laughs> I've been tasting your fear all night. Now it's time to feast! Ew, this house is a giant fear-eating monster and angler is the tongue? Gross. I'm impressed, terrified, and disgusted all at the same time! <laughs> I don't know how long I can hang on! I don't know how long my legs can hang on! Help! <laughs> Maggie can't help. He's a scaredy nana poo-poo. Yum, yum, yum. You know, angler? Waffle and Waldo isn't my biggest fear. It isn't? Then what is? Yeah! <laughs> Letting down my pals! <laughs> what are you doing? Taking a bite out of my own fear! <laughs> mm, crunchy waffle and juicy hamburger. Not bad. Not bad at all. Well, let's sweeten the deal! <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> I can't get enough! Stop it! I order you to be afraid! Sorry, Angler! No can do! McGee is back! Yay! Oh, well, this is what I get for playing with my food. Now get out and stay up! So rude! See? That cabin's not so scary. Come on, guys. Let's head home. Lake Bottom's just past that rock. I think. There you are, Otis. <laughs> Got anything else, Rosebud? Yeah. Pan snakes, Belgian offals, and Canadian bat bacon with hash browns. <laughs> oh, no! uh, awesome. Smoky bacon hair for the rest of the day. You say that like it's a bad thing. Uh, anything on the menu that doesn't squeal, fly, or bite? <laughs> Thanks, Otis. Only the hash browns. <laughs> but they're not very good because I forgot to coat them in skunk juice. Mm, oh, yeah. mm -hmm. oh, hints of salt and pepper. Starchy goodness. No gag reflex. This is... Actual, actual potato! potato! More, please! please! More potatoes? We're all out! And I wouldn't suggest digging in the spud patch. Potato! <laughs> Come to 
join the hoedown? Aw, oh, that's cute, because you're not invited. What the spider are you doing to our potato patch? Potato patch? <laughs> no, 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 no. This is the perfect place for my pageant prize ball, duh! Plus, I get to test drive my jet-powered backhoe. <laughs> can lock yourself in there, too? I can't. It's too full already. Heavy is the head that wears the pageant crown. Oh, but you wouldn't know that, would you, little Miss Runner-Up? Oh, you're a... Send it back! Uh, it's a new toy! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Leave no tater behind! Carrot surround sound jet powered back home. Drop the drama. Get me my Miss Junior World fish fillet crown. Who dares disturb the subterranean potato underground dwellers? <laughs> Him, no, 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 no. Mickey's Mickey's butt's not disturber. and his squatty back goes totally to stinky button. Silence! Ooh, shiny. Mine. Get your filthy potato skin away from my Junior Miss Fish Filet crown. <gasps> I'm the pageant princess. That's my crown. Princess? More like my prisoner. <laughs> oh, let me go, you dirty tuber. Okay. Come on, guys. We gotta get... Uh, is there any way I can convince you of the upside of this situation? Susie's only been gone for ten seconds, and already the future seems brighter. Cowards! I'll totally help by being the lookout from a safe location, like Sunny Smiles. Oh, boy. Who knows what terrible things the Spuds could be doing to Susie? You mean like hammering her with potato stands? Zapping her with a potato battery? Growing new Susies from bits of her body? I mean, I'm sure she's fine. <laughs> Somebody better let me out of here, or I swear I'll eat all of you for breakfast! See? Like I said, bye. Oof, great. Gotta go. Bye. So something's tickling my neck. Please tell me it's Squirt that's tickling my neck. Not me. I'm more of a belly rubber. There must be a thousand of them. One potato, two potato. Nope. Just two potato. That's still two potatoes too many. Yeah! Oh. 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 It's the bottom diggers' fault. They're the ones invading your creepy, dirty underground kingdom. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love what you've done with the place. It's unpretentious, it's rustic. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you know, I think we just got off on the wrong foot. Or whatever you potatoes have. We're here to negotiate for my sister's return. Perhaps I don't want to return her. If you get dirt on my Junior World Fish Filet crown, I'll peel you like a banana! Hmm, for her return, what do you got? Let's show Kingy what he can win! <laughs> Time supply of bacon bits! Oh. A gravy boat! Oh. No! A gravy yacht? Mm, uh, I'm a king. Uh, give me something I don't already have. <coughs> well, um, <clears throat> okay. Oh, oh! <laughs> chips! Everybody loves chips! What? You dare present me with my deep-fried brethren and rub salt and vinegar in their wounds? Seize the overgrounders! Grab Susie! I'll deal with these thin-skinned spuds! Oh, <laughs> what salty, crunchy relatives! <laughs> Later, taters! Take me with you! <sighs> oh, 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 these ow. things are chafing my flawless skin! <laughs> Potato King, my beautiful crown! Me! Hey, careful! <laughs> you really should floss more. Yo, Spud! 
head. Huh? <laughs> Booyah! Give me a little help here. Ah! Thanks. I said give me. <laughs> All right, you overlanders. Ooh, shiny. End of the line. <laughs> My glorious golden hose! All aboard the Tater Express! I'm tattling my way to freedom! <laughs> Looks like I saved you again, McCrud. Thanks to me, there's no more tater trouble. <laughs> no more crowns! I wouldn't be so sure of that. <laughs> Down. Actually, I was planning on going up. <laughs> Please tell me your campers didn't mess with the spuds. Uh, maybe. <laughs> Not the face! Not the face! <laughs> oh, right in the face! <laughs> Let me down! Tuber has my crown and I want it back. Mm. And I want back bacon. What? All this running away and terrified horror just makes me hungry. Squirt, you're a genius! If you can't feed him, eat him! Time for a potato massacre. <laughs> we have broken through your protective skin. I love the smell of fried potatoes in the morning. <laughs> Take no prisoners, Spuds! Take no prisoners! <laughs> 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 Overgrounders, what you're made of! Yeah, that's not what I meant. Looks like they've got this one. Let's go! Not without my crown! Let <laughs> go of me! Never sneak up on us, bud. We've got eyes on the backsides and top of our heads. You put my sister down! <laughs> oh, I will down my throat. <laughs> Although that was kind of cool. Hmm, <laughs> <sighs> a little bitter with hints of salt, hairspray, and <gasps> heat. Whoa, <laughs> that's not agreeing with the old tater dummy. <laughs> uh, oh, hot, hot, too hot. Let's get one thing clear. No one wears this crown but me! That's better. Okay, Butt Squat. Vault, move, now. Mm. Uh, nothing makes Susie's blood boil faster than messing with her pageant prizes. You haven't heard the last of us, Mickey! The spots will rise again! Time for a victory feast! Oh, I will make mad. Oh, well, uh, Rosebud. I think I speak for all of us when I say anything but potatoes. Creepiest camp around. More terror tomorrow. Mm. Sleep tight, campers. Don't let the dream weevil burrow into your brain. Right, a dream weevil. 
good one, Sawyer. Yeah, you're hilarious. Dream who's it? Ruined my what? The dream weaver? Oh, it's a bug that gets into your head and turns your dreams into nightmares. Uh, cool. Does it dig into your skull or crawl in through your ear? Squirt! Can it eat your face from the inside out? Or, or, or when you shake your head, can you hear it rattling around? Hmm, I'm not sure, probably. Whoa. I'm not listening! No, no, no! Aw, McGee's afraid of a scary dream bug. Mm -hmm. I ain't afraid of nothing. Ah, what is that thing? It's just a fright light. It scares away bad dream. Ah. Here, fight terror with horror. Uh, thanks. But couldn't we fight terror with something that looks a little happier? See you tomorrow if you, you know, you survive the night and all. Dream weevil. Totally ridiculous. Right, guys? Guys? <laughs> I will not dream about the dream weevil. 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 Wow, I slept great. You see, Gretch? I didn't even need the fright light. Gretch? Squirt? Huh, I guess I slept in. Gretch, squirt, what do you guys want to do? Well, soccer it is then. Hup, hup, oh! Twinkle Toes McGee works his magic. Goal! Wow. That good night's sleep really helped my game. Yo, guys, where are you? This year's Little Miss Ninja winner is... That would be... Scratch! Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Go, Gretch! Hey there, mixed scaredy pants. Awesome dream. Scaredy pants? I'm not afraid. Wait, I'm dreaming? <laughs> yeah. Cool. But I knew you guys were making that up. There is no dream weaving. Hey, Ixnay on the aim nay, or you'll ruin your whole dream. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, a uh, little busy. Uh, why don't you check what Squirt's up to? Ha, ha, ice cream! <laughs> Hey, Sawyer! You're in my dream, too? You bet. I notice there's no sign of the you-know-what. <laughs> Give me a break. You just made that up. Right? Here you go. Ew! Any flavors other than brainy? Hmm, got brainy with nuts, brainy with chocolate sprinkles, and my favorite, tutti fruity brainy. Maybe later. Suit yourself. All the more for me. You enjoy that. Have you seen Squirt? Squirt's got his head in the clouds. As usual. In that case, one Rainbow Express going up! One of the dreamiest dreams you've ever dreamed up, McGee. Yeah! And if you've wanted to stay that way, don't say the name of the... <laughs> All right, are you guys trying to freak me out about this dream we... <laughs> McGee! Thank you for my uni bubble corn. Blow hello, Bessie. <laughs> I can't believe you guys were so worried about that silly old dream wheel. Shh! If that thing hears its name, it'll ruin your dream. Okay, okay, I get it. I won't talk about that goofy... Made up... Dream Weevil! <laughs> Which part of Don't Say the Name did you not understand? Isn't so bad. <laughs> you calling McGee? You're the dream weevil? <laughs> You're not so scary. Oh, really? Because you sure look scared. <laughs> I tried to warn you, but... You just wouldn't listen. Tisk, tisk. <laughs> oh, I smell fear. <laughs> fear, my favorite snack. <laughs> What we need is a jetpack! 
guess this thing's good for something after all. Eat rocket dust, Dream Weevil! <laughs> 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 Me. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Hello again. Ah! Get a grip, McGee. Freaking out makes the dream evil stronger. You got that right, Missy. <laughs> nice flying, Gretch. I think we lost him. Oh, <laughs> I smell fear. The only thing I'm afraid of is your bad breath. Ugh, total gag. Oh, you're not afraid? Oh, oh, ah, oh. Who needs you anyway? It's McGee's dream I'm haunting. Right, McGee? No! I'm not afraid of you! Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> That's why I'm gonna stay and turn your dreams ah! into nightmares forever! <laughs> Where's a unit bubblegorn when you need one? Oh, yeah! I'm not going to say I told you so. So I will. I told you so. Hey! I didn't mean to invite the dream weevil into my dream. I just wanted to prove I'm not afraid. Not afraid? Then how can I do this? Oh, that does it! Bright light, do your stuff! I wish we had tanks! Huh? Fire! you could get rid of me with that silly light. <laughs> now that's what I call fear power. McGee, you got to get control of your dream. Wait a sec. It is my dream. It's my dream you're haunting. Leave my friends alone. Oh, no. Thanks to you, I'm in their dreams, too. And now we're one big screaming family. Impossible! Ah! I don't need a fright light to change my dreams! Ah! Ah! Whoa! I did that? Your dreams, your power. Well, in that case, Dreamy, meet your worst nightmare!
Top that, Squirt! Easy! <laughs> Take a break, Slimy! Now feel the force of my atomic cannonball! Feel the force of my sonic boom wave rider! Wet ah! incoming! Ah! It's sand! Bottom dwellers! <laughs> butt squat! I got sand in my butt squat! <laughs> More like butt splat! You're lucky jet skis come in packs of five, McGee. Ooh, swim! Watch out! Swim! Butt squat, get out of the water! What are you, my moms? Mommy! Okay, bring it back when you're done! <laughs> Thanks for the hand, Sawyer. I landed a butt squat, but it's kind of shrimpy. Let's mm. throw it back. <laughs> wow, that's a big fish. Old toothy. Hmm. <whistles> the lake is officially closed. No one is allowed in the water. Not you guys. Hmm. Sawyer, you can't let some ridiculously huge kid-eating fish ruin our fun. Toothy is more than a fish. He's the biggest, scariest, toothiest thing in the lake. And he was almost mine. Ha! Your smell is worse than your slap, little Toothy. That's not how I remember it. Look at me! Look at me! Well, the tooth finally comes out. Bad move, butt brain. Fish the size of elephants never forget. Whatever. I win, because I got this. Oh. Ah. Hey, you can't keep that. Why not? He doesn't need it. He doesn't have a beautiful smile like me. Thanks for the souvenir, fish face. Catch you later, losers! <laughs> Sorry, campers, beach is closed. It's just not safe with old Toothy lurking around. Seriously? No more swimming? Oh. <sighs> Looks like summer's over. Oh, we will swim again. I'm getting one of my always works foolproof plans. Well, you've got the fool part right. Great plan, McGee. Old Toothy could flip this rig just by winking. Not on my watch, campers. I'm on the job, ready for action. Nothing will get past. And he's out. Looks like we're on our own. We can handle it. Now let's find Toothy so we can get our beach reopened. Do your stuff, Squirt. Oh, sure thing, McGee. <gasps> Hyperspeed, engage! Hold on, everybody! Wow, I think I got whiplash. <laughs> this looks like the perfect spot to catch a monsterific fish. Oh, nah, these are my friends! Use those for lunch instead! Whoa, that is one impressive stank! Good idea, Squirt! Rosebud's food is never a good idea. I'm impressed. <laughs> Whoa! Something likes her cooking. No toothy, but we could have a wicked garage sale. We're trying to catch old Toothy! No, you back off! That fish 
music belongs stuffed and mounted over my fireplace. Bye-bye now. Right back at ya. <laughs> that fish bit me in the butt, so I'm going to return the favor. You're gonna bite him in the butt? What? No. Listen, Butt Squat, you've already been bitten. I mean, beaten once. Why don't you head back to Sunny Smiles and leave Toothy to us? Uh, McGee, I think we're about to become the creamy filling in a fish and Butt Squat sandwich. On second thought, he's all yours, Butt Squat. this through. Thought this through. Yeah! Time to play dentist, Dr. Squirt. This is gonna hurt me more than it's gonna hurt you. Well, not really. <laughs> Wish I had my mouth closed for that. <laughs> Told you my plans always work. Lucky yachts come in packs of seven, McGee. I can fit you in for repair and cleaning, say, Friday at 10. <gasps> My gorgeous smile! You'll pay for this, McGee! <laughs> I will have revenge! But you can't top this!
man number one. Phew. Oh, that was a close one, guys. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh! Squirt! Why can't we use a real alarm like normal people? Mm, what's not normal about us? <laughs> <laughs> Sleep well, Jerry? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. I was farting and snoring. <laughs> you weren't exactly singing lullabies. Whoa. <sighs> oh, thanks, guys. Another perfect day, Kim. Here, Rhino Chick Chick. Here, Rhino Chick Chick. All right. Gotta look both ways in case of Rhino Chicken Stand. <laughs> Should have checked the animal traffic report. Hey! How many times do I have to tell you guys not to borrow my clothes? <laughs> Aw, I just can't stay mad at you. Ah, who has time for mad when you're hungry? Let's get some breakfast. Oh, sorry, McGee! Give the head to the body, monkey. <laughs> Interception! And McGee makes the pasta Sawyer. Ow, oh, ow, oh, not sure this is better. <laughs> Sorry, Sawyer. Oh. Out, out! Back to the nether regions where you belong. <laughs> Enjoy. Aww. I hope you don't mind. We started breakfast without you. <sighs> <laughs> Can't a guy sit without getting a butt full of quills and a nose full of stink? Yeah! <laughs> this is supposed to be a totally terrifying monster camp, not a totally annoying zoo. <gasps> <gasps> Sorry I lost my temper. Sometimes your furry friends and I don't see things eye to eye, and that's okay. <laughs> Because no matter how many shirts they burn from my body, I have a place for them right here. <laughs> oh, Jerry, how did you get in there? I don't know. Yeah, but I don't want to know. The point is, I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Am I right, guys? Yes! <gasps> no! My God! I've had enough of this furry freak show. Well, some of these freaks have feathers and scales, you know, and I'm pretty sure they didn't mean to. I don't want to hear it. From now on, no more animals in this cabin. McGee, you might want to rethink that. My best friend wouldn't make me choose between him and my animals. Huh. Well, then maybe you and me are... <gasps> are you saying what I think you're saying? I'm saying that this is... In that case, goodbye, former friend. Come on, guys. We'll start our own camp upriver, where humans and freaks can have comic book fires in peace and harmony. Squirt! No monkeys allowed! What? Squirt, wait! I was only kidding. <laughs> Slimy, don't you go too. Aw, oh, smooth move, McGee. <sighs> uh, where's Squirt going? I don't know what happened, but I'm guessing it was all your fault. Relax. Squirt and I may have had a little disagreement, but they'll be back as soon as they get hungry. No. <laughs> well, that might not be for a while. What if? Squirt brought this on himself. Now, who's for an exciting game of Go Fish? How about an exciting game of Go Get Your Friend? Why? He made his choice, and these feet are not moving from this spot! Ah! My Arachnoman number one is still in mint condition! Follow that comic! No, 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 not Arachnoman! Phew! It's just my fridge magnet man number 17, <laughs> and I got three of those. Oh, what a relief. Ah! But I've only got two hands! Just paddle! <laughs> <laughs> It looks like we lost him, thanks to my power paddling. I think it was less about the paddling and more about that. They call that a waterfall. 
More like a water bun. <gasps> Mickey, look! Huh? Oh, I like what Squid's done with the place. <laughs> Me too. You never looked so good. Come on, we'll just tell Squirt we happen to be in the neighborhood. Wow! Check it out. Squirt sure knows how to make an impression. Not bad. Guy's been away for a couple of hours, too. Imagine what he'd do with a week. <laughs> nice way to treat guests. I am Colonel Squirts, King of Squirtopia. In my land, there is but one rule. No McGee's allowed. And Sundays shall only be eaten on Tuesdays, so really that's two rules. But the most important one is no McGee's allowed. Uh, oh. McGee? Oh. oh, right, it's Thursday. <laughs> Leave Scortopia, McGee, before things start to get crazy. Start to get crazy? Maybe we should go get help. No way! Not without my comic! You mean... Colonel Squirtz's comic. Bingo! That's the one! Come on, Gretch! Let's fly! Sounds like a plan! <laughs> Stop squirming, Squirt! We're trying to take you home! This is my home! Untie the boat, Gretch! Untie! Untie! Squirtopians are coming! Oh, I'm, I'm trying! <laughs> Fall that coffin. <laughs> hey! We're losing them! Um, forget about what's behind us. Uh, look what's in front! Wow, I really gotta start paying more attention to where I'm paddling. too far gone to listen. You know, he's a lot like you. That's not true. I'm making completely rational decisions. Now, let's paddle into the whirlpool! What? No! Trust me, would I risk harming a limited edition first issue? You got a point. You're not getting away! A key! Just paddle, Gretch. Never escape, Colonel Squirts. Right now, we've got bigger problems. <laughs> Hermione, Herman, Francis, Sigmund, Biff, Cupcake, Sticky, and Sticky. I'm coming! Squirt, no! It's too dangerous! I don't care. They're my friends! <laughs> if they're your friends, that makes them my friends, too. Don't worry, buddy. I'll save them. <gasps> Not your Arachno Man number one. <laughs> Squirt, there's only two number ones in my life. Gretchen and you! Never fear! McGee the animal lover is here! Grab hold, fellas. <laughs> Sorry about your comic, McGee. Yeah, that was a big sacrifice, best friend. Hey, no worries, buddy. It's still totally readable. Story time! In the first panel, we meet Arachnoman, a superhero who will do anything for his friends. And his friends' friends, too. Ew! If I'm gonna be enveloped in a stinky fart cloud, I'm glad it's with my best friend. Uh, thanks? thanks?
Okay, I'm confused. Is this fort part of Old Camp Lake Bottom or Old Camp Sunny Smiles? Both. The two camps used to be one big camp. Sunny Bottom. I worked here. Wow, wow. really? Really? Hello? Hello? <gasps> Madame, do not panic. Help is on the way. <laughs> but perhaps not for some time. Just how old are you, Sawyer? A zombie never tells. Besides, I still got a good brain inside. <laughs> My noggin. Guys, a little help here. <laughs> zombie earwax. Slipperier than a slick oyster slider. Whoa. No wonder his brain keeps slipping out. <laughs> 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 Check out the cool lid. Careful, camper. Legend has it a spirit haunts this hat. His spirit. General Butt. General Butt and I were counselors. Ahem. I wanted a camp where campers could have fun. <laughs> but Butt wanted the whole place to be one big no fun zone. We decided to settle it over a friendly game of capture the flag. Church! But he turned it into an all-out war. Finally, I captured the flag. But Butt wasn't a good loser. <laughs> After that, Sunny Bottom was split in two. My camp Lake Bottom and General Cheater Pants' Camp Sunny Smile. Liar, liar, zombie pants on fire! <gasps> General Butt won fair and square. So this is my fort, my flag, and that's my great, great, great granddaddy. And one more great, because he's so great. Old Cannonball Bum here fled the battle, and Lake Bottom has been Loserville ever since. That's not true. Old Cannonball Bum fled the battle and Lake Bottom has been Loserville ever since. Well, maybe it is. Except for the Cannonball Bum part. Listen up, Bottom Dwellers are not losers. How about a rematch to prove it, huh, Buttloaf? And when we win, you fly the Lake Bottom flag at Sunny Smiles. Fine by me, McGonna Lose. And when you lose, you admit Bottom Losers are the loseriest losers that ever lose. Deal! <laughs> gonna lose. No, campers, not capture the flag. It does terrible things to people. Relax, Sawyer. It's just a game. Am I the only one using my head? This baby needs a seatbelt. This game is dangerous. The flag flies in my fort, where it belongs. And when we capture it and hang it on Sawyer's statue, we win. Street rules, no holds barred. But no pinching. Got it. No butt cheating. No modern tech. No moving the flag. Oh, and no wet willies. Fine. <laughs> Prepare your loser engines for full throttle loseringness. All right, you heard him. Today we restore the honor of our camp forefathers. Now who's with me? Charge! I don't have any other plans. Everybody's yelling! You take point. Squirt, you keep watch. Questions? Oh, oh! What do you get when you cross a vampire and a snowman? Frostbite. Anyone else? Hey, how about a nature hike? Far away from any place with flags or cannons. Ah, uh, later, Sawyer. Kind of busy here. Squirt, diversion time. I've been waiting all my life to hear that.
Coming up with a side order of not losing. <laughs> hey, no fair! <laughs> so close and yet so lame. Oh! Thank you, Gretchen! <laughs> you know the rules. <laughs> no tech! Rules are made to be followed by losers. We are not losers! Launch me, Gretchen! A tough act to follow. I'm fine. No thanks to butt cheese. <laughs> <laughs> no, it can't be. N -n 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 not you. You bet your knob is up and knees. It's me, General Butts, back to end your lily liver camp for good. Wow, I didn't think to add a no evil ghost rule. Richard! <laughs> Oh, I will, but uh, 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 time to settle up, McLost. What does the loser say? Oh, right. Yeah, normally this would bother me, but <clears throat> I'm McGee, and the loseriest loser who ever lost. And I'm proud to live in the loserest camp with the best loserest friends and the greatest loser zombie a loser ever lost with. So let's hear it for losers! 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 Ha, only a loser likes being a loser. 
I'm way happier here. All alone. With my flag. Hey, guys, wait for me. I want to be a loser, too. Huh. A lizard whisperer. Could you whisper to her to stop making me sneeze? Oh, uh, uh, sure. As soon as I shamelessly beg Armand to let me keep her. Can I, Armand? Can I keep her, please? Please? Well, I suppose. As long as you promise to take proper care of her. I can teach McGee everything about pets with my handy pocket guide. Whoa, that's some pocket. Okay, lesson number one, discipline. Discipline? <laughs> I can't discipline my bud. Besides, she doesn't need it. That's girl. See? Perfectly trained. Hey, you little repto-klepto. Let go of my planter. This is so dignified. You might want to rinse that. an awesome lizardy name like uh uh popcorn noodle lizzie and I, oh, oh, oh what is that a poopy pile of responsibility <laughs> lesson number two feeding <gasps> uh manners observe hermione yummy time Ooh, good etiquette ah, easy peasy hey lizzie yummy time <laughs> okay she needs a little practice. There, all stopped up. What can I say? Lizzie likes you. Uh, I'm flattered. Good night. Lesson number three, boundaries. Playtime's over. Time for sleep. Aw, did Uncle Squirt make you mad? Mm. Here, girl, I have a stuffy. <laughs> That'll make you feel better, huh? Well, sleeping on the floor is okay for a regular pet, but Lizzie's my pal. Suit yourself. She's your pet. I, I mean, pal. Good night. Lizzie, you got big, coolness. That's because she's a dragon. And you know dragons aren't meant to be pets. Even more coolness! <laughs> if you insist on keeping her, then we'd better get her outside. I told you dragons are my work! Wow! Look at my dragon go! Yeah, look at your dragon. I... All over the place. No problemo. I'm all over it. Whoa, you're definitely gonna need a bigger bag. Oh, and you might need this too. Oh, right. There. That takes care of the last of it. Too bad it doesn't take care of the smell. I don't know. I kind of like the smell. And it's warm, like Grandma's fresh baked brownie. Finally, we can have some fun. Okay, Lizzie, want the stick? Want it? Do you? Fetch, girl! Uh, <laughs> Who knew a stick 
could be so entertaining. Me, I love sticks. But trees, <gasps> not so much. No, 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 wrong stick! <laughs> no, 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 wrong stick! Drop it, Lizzie. <laughs> I think we made her mad. Lizzie! Uh, here's a stuffy. Plus, it's breakfast time. You like breakfast? <laughs> Uh, she knows breakfast doesn't need us, right? I hope so! Uh, <laughs> ten times the pet means ten times the... Uh... And ten times the allergies. Uh... And ten times the terror! Come on, get it, Lizzie! Bowser, don't be so snatchy. Hey, I think she's getting the hang of it. At least she didn't eat Rosebud's head. Achoo! Oh, that's all there is, greedy guts. So <laughs> all the skilly tantrums you want. No more food for you. <laughs> that slinky stinker cleaned out the pantry. Bad idea. No. All she needs is some of that discipline that you were talking about in your book. Bad dragon. Bad, bad dragon. Uh, what does the book say to do now? Oh, I'm guessing it says... <laughs> Wonder what Rosebud's cooked up today. <laughs> Apparently it's barbecue. <laughs> Teach that young dragon some old tricks. Lizzie, shit! May I suggest we start with a trick known as Stop with the Burning? Uh, Squirt, any advice in your pocket guide on how to save our necks? Um, let's see here. Um, uh, no, there's nothing because dragons are pets! Uh, Squirt, I think it's stuffy time. <laughs> Good idea, except that I don't have it. Squirt, duck! Oh, dear. Squirt! I told you dragons aren't meant to be pets. Tell the world my story. Oh, man, Squirt was right. They're headed to Mount Finneblow. Now we'll never find them. Actually... I think we will. The nose, nose, Gretch. Follow that dragon. Achoo! This way. Achoo! Over there. Achoo! This way. Are you sure it's this way? Yeah, I'm sure. Achoo! Nope, it's this way. Achoo! Getting close. Way to go, Gretch. <laughs> In there. All right, Gretch, you found him. Come on, it's rescue time. I'm right behind you. We're too late. Oh, hey, guys. I'm fine, but maybe you could give me a hand. I'm honored to be Lizzie's new squishy toy, but her canines are a little bit pinchy. Here's the plan. Gretch is going to distract her. I grab your arm and... Achoo! Okay, we're just gonna run. That good. Ah, we're trapped! I'm sorry, McGee, but that pet book is useless. We're doomed! Wait, maybe not. Here, Lizzie, want a boogie book? Yes, you do, girl. You want a bookie book. Here it is, girl. Fetch! Please land in a bush. Please land in a bush. This calls for a victory lap. Oh. <laughs> 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 Any sign of them? 
Da-da. Uh, Air Dragon is on final approach. Whoa! A little turbulence. What, girl? See, guys? We're back safe and sound. Wow! I gotta admit it, McGee. You're a real pet owner now. Aw, oh, thanks, Squirt. But you were right. Lizzie's definitely not a pet. Off you go, Lizzie. Mm. Aw, oh, don't be sad. You can still come visit. Oh, ow, ow, hot tongue, hot tongue, hot tongue. Oh. Aw, uh, have a snot stuffy, Lizzie. We made it from Gretchen's tissues. <laughs> Bye, Lizzie. Gee, I'm gonna miss her. But I'm definitely not gonna miss that. Little Miss Goldilocks pageant. Scoozy, Susie, Snotty Smiles Fly coming through. <gasps> McGee! Gretchen! Hop in, Suze. It's payback time. My fave time of day. Really? One second breakfast. Uh, I thought you were trading me for my kick buddy tough gal challenge. Uh, I am. We got running, jumping. <laughs> We're bugging Susie. <sighs> that should be worth bonus points. Ha! Give me back my flag, McSteely! <sighs> Make me butt whiner. <laughs> Watch it, Jordan! You're getting nature in my hair. <laughs> Don't mess with the butster. <sighs> I think I'll butt in, butster. Yeah, you didn't call John. Now that's a problem. Uh huh. Yep. Pipe rats chewed clean through it. <laughs> yeah, a uh, pipe rats. This calls for Chimera glue. If you got things to stick together, Chimera glue fuses them forever. Perfect. Now let's test it. Okay. It worked. Not one drop. Oops. Speaking of drops. Cool. It made us summer. Now we can saw stuff in half and hammer it back together at the same time. Let go. You let go. You let go. I said you let I go. I said you let go. I'm not listening let to go. you. Let go. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Epic ride! Everyone in one piece? Nope, but we're working on it. Oh, guess puzzles aren't your thing, Camper. Woohoo! Best kick buddy workout ever! <gasps> Ew! You got sand in my uh, everything! Let go of my arm! I'm not touching your arm! Let go of my foot! As if I touch your grody foot! Ah! It's horrid, Terry. It's worse than my worst nightmare. It's even worse than that. It's... Groozy. What? Yeah, they must have got the chimera glue on them. <laughs> we'll go find a fix, <laughs> if there is one. How will I win Miss Goldilocks stuck to this mutant tub? How do I train for the cave buddy with this airhead attached to me? Who are you calling an airhead? Who are you calling a mutant? Whoa, 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 whoa! Grad training for kick buddy is still priority numero uno. Whoa, 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 no way! Susie's golden hair thingy outranks Freakazoid sweat vest. Come on, it does not. It, of course, it does it obviously not. does. La, 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 Come on! La, 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 la. Stop yakking and start fixing! <gasps> okay, good luck, Bot's not. No, 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 don't leave me. Ah! 
Gretch, being monster strong is monster awesome. I know, right? Then I could bench press the cabin. Okay, so I'll just draw this red stuff around your mouth. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, don't worry, Suze. Your freakishly long neck sets off your delicate features. So true. Blocks, don't smell! <laughs> I got some seriously nice hair, butt squat. A key? Hold this while I chalk up. <laughs> Get your bottom cooties off my Luminous Lassie face powder! No, it's pen chalk! No, it's face powder! Can't you guys try to get along? <laughs> It's just too bad about your face. Take turns, okay? Gretchen's first. Hey, why's Ninja Nerd going first? It's okay, Jordan. She can go first. Wait a minute. Are you being nice? Um, I'm always nice, and I've got the Miss Sweetie Pie crown to prove it. That was supposed to be my crown. Well, I guess the judges just thought sugar and spice is nicer than sweaty and smelly. Uh, I'll show you, sweaty and... Okay! <laughs> Come on, work it off, Gretch. Take it out on this, all right? Let's go. Fine! <laughs> Let's try this again. I'm nice. Oh. 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 Yeah. Ah. Oh. See how nice I am? Oh. Oh. Maybe a little less nice. Oh. Nice time's over. My turn. Oh. I'm telling you nicely, it's still my turn! Huh? Yeah. My oh. turn! No, it's mine! No, no it is mine! No. Uh, good thing I got the ambulance on speed dial. Ow. What should we try next? Dragon spit. Dragon spit. Negative. Earwax. Oh. Earwax. <laughs> Negatory. This baby's fused tighter than a gargoyle's butt cheeks. Hey, I'm crying. Maybe I'm sad that gargoyles' butts are so tight they can't poop. Or it's because of that. Good work. This ought to plug it for the moment. Now all we gotta do is find Gloozy to give her a good soaking. My turn! Oh, my turn! Oh, Gloozy! My turn. My turn. My turn. <laughs> Guys, Gloozy's out of control. <sighs> Good to know. Gretchen started it. Oh, she did not. She did not. No, 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 she did it. No need for a dust up. We found a way to separate Groozy. What are we waiting for? Let's go. So that's where the chimera glue went. Missed me. Ah, dang it. We don't need a cage, we need Rosie! We're coming, guys! Uh, there is no way I'm fighting that grody monster! Our only chance is to soak that thing! But my arm won't let go! Let go, Susie! Oh, what's it take to get you to help? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You guys hit that way out of the park. See, we step up to the plate when the pressure's on. A funny thing about pressure. Darcy <gasps> I'm back. Admittedly filthy, but 100%. Me. Oh, man, and I'm free of your whining. Come on, Jordan. Sunny smiles and make it snappy. All right, so long, bottom weirdos. Uh oh. Ugh. It's not my fault. It jumped out in front of me. Bird 
thingy has already messed up my style enough for one day. How about if we do it bruisey style? That's more like it. Never happened. I'd die before telling. It's my flag! Why are you always taking my stuff? Because it's yours! Come on, Come on! Come on. Oh, oh, see, look what you did. of earwax so bad, it filled up the ears and seeped into the brain. I also saw a case of toe jam so bad that it brought its own toe peanut butter. Oh, I just love my new drum set. <laughs> I'd better take extreme measures. Don't worry. I almost graduated from earwax removal night school. What? Earwax removal apparatus. Earwax removal apparatus. Now relax and loosen your eardrum. What? Pickles <laughs> 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 are swooping and giggling. <laughs> Campers, we'll help. <laughs> hey, I can hear. I can. Sneaky, <laughs> help. Of course. The noises in my head were just my friend's desperate cries for help. What a relief. Lake bottom to squirt. Are you going to help us get rid of this wax or not? Oh, yeah, 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 sure. How hard can it be to get rid of a giant ball of my own earwax? camp so we don't smell that stuff anymore. We are out of here. Wait! Are we just gonna leave the wax here? You saw how hard it tried to not be gotten rid of, right? <laughs> I, I think my hearing's going again. I... It's me, Squirt. 
You ax. You can't toss me out like trash, Squirt. I am part of you. You're right. I'll find a way to get my pals to accept you, Earwax. You're coming back with me. Well, bit by bit, because you're kind of big. Nothing like recovering from a long morning of earwax removal with two lunch specials, Rosebud. <laughs> uh, Rosebud? Hello? Uh, Rosebud? No offense, but you don't look so good. I mean, more than usual. Uh, yeah. Maybe we'll come back for lunch. At dinner time! Sawyer, I don't want to freak you out, but Rosebud is kind of melting. Sawyer? <laughs> It's happening. The meltdown is happening. We are on Melt Alert 1, people. Hey, guys. So playing Melt Alert again, huh? Hey, I'd love to join in, but uh, I've been super busy with all my earwax sculpting. Oh, right. earwax sculptures. Aren't they so realistic? Perfect likeness. If he was trapped in a vat of face-melting toxic goo. I can keep this up all day long. I know you guys wanted me to leave the earwax, but I found a perfect use for it. Check it out! Our very own Lake Bottom Earwax Museum! Look, guys, it's you! Aren't they so lifelike? You could say, I don't need the real thing anymore. <laughs> yeah, well, it's hard to appreciate art when the stank makes you want to barf. Unless it's barf art. But, or, <gasps> wait for it, toenail art. I found a ton of yours in my pillowcase. One of the downsides of being in the bottom bunk. But anyways, they're all yours. So just go ahead, Squirt. Come on, make me proud. Hi! <laughs> Squirt! What is the deal? I was only trying to be a good pal. If you were a good pal, you never would have made me abandon my earwax. Oh, oh, okay. Well, you know what? Maybe I'll use the toenails and make a sculpture myself. How'd you like that? Huh, Squirt? <laughs> Well, Squirt, how did the statues go over? Are your friends ready to accept Earwax back in the lake bottom? I, I tried to convince them, Earwax, but they just couldn't see the beauty of your earwaxiness. <laughs> Can't they see we belong together? You <laughs> know, Squirt, there is a way we all can be together forever. I've been looking everywhere for Squirt, and I... <gasps> McGee? What do you think, Gretch? Too literal? Too smelly? Huh. Either way, it is so much more awesome than earwax art. This is what you were doing while I've been looking under every rock and every bush for Squirt? Shh, Gretch. Let me sculpt you. Your hair is the exact same black as the gunk you find under your nails. Oh, come on. At least let me clip some of your cuticles. I run out so fast. Mickey, I... Oh, 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 oh. oh good. <laughs> so nice of you to drop in. But um bum ching Oh, it's just not the same. Now, my best friends and my precious earwax will be united together in the ultimate earwax mixture. I'm so... <laughs> oh! <laughs> Squirt, this is nutty. Um, earwax? Is this nutty? Hmm, earwax says it's totally nut-free. So there. Earwax, <laughs> you say such sweet things. <laughs> Okay, Squirt's gone nuts. Aha! Has everyone gone sculpture nutty? Yeah, nutty like a toenail sculpting squirrel. Check this out. <laughs> no! Not the swab! <laughs> I must say, even though I am covered in melted earwax, I'm so impressed at how you campers release your artistic flair. Thanks. Now, how about I release you? No, wait. <laughs> oh, look what you've done to poor Earwax. He's half the ball of Earwax he used to be. <laughs> no! I've heard of Vex build up, but this is ridiculous! 
ridiculous! Run! Hold these! Time to nail it in! Really, Minnie? How can you heal sculpt at a time like this? I do my best work with Pants Wedding Terror as my inspiration. Are you all ready to become part of the Earwax Collective? Sure, Squirt, why not? Hey, I even made you an earwaxing warming gift. I call it McGee and Squirt, when Squirt isn't trying to melt McGee. Okay, the title needs work, but isn't it beautiful? <laughs> yeah, McGee, it's, it's breath-tokingly beautiful. <laughs> See what I did there? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Okay, totally got it. <laughs> you sure did. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I know some puns too. Isn't my wax interesting? <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm in the toenails now. Squirt, watch out! <laughs> Squirt! No, oh, we'll save you. Ew! Most disgusting rescue ever. <laughs> Are you okay, old pal? What? Oh, come on! I can't go through all that again. <laughs> Hello. What's this doing in here? Oh! So that's where that went. So it wasn't the wax taking control over your brain. It was this toilet brush poking your cortex. That makes sense. What's a cortex? Bada boom, ching. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, I can't remember what anything is. They've been screaming forever. All I feel is the need to get out of this insane house of horrors. Let me go! Huh? He's watching all of our moves. Just act like yourselves. Get it? Look at me! I'm Gretchen! Look at me! I'm the brave and charming, armpit musically talented McGee! <laughs> la 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 la. Come on, Squirt, it's your turn! I am Squirt, and I have the ultimate power in the universe. <gasps> <laughs> All right, ultimate fartquake power. Escape in progress at Camper Habitat. Intestinal fumes detected. Quick, we gotta get out of here and free the monsters from this place. Follow me. <laughs> Wait, the doorknob isn't real. How do we get out now? That was convenient, I'll say. Do you guys hear that? Mutant moles? Hey, little buddy. Big fan of your tunnel work. I think they're saying that we need to dance the okie koki. Or maybe that we're in extreme danger. It's kind of hard to make out the dialect. Squirt, ask them if they know their way around and if they know how to find the master of this horrible house. Again with the dancing? We haven't got time. We're on a mission. That dancing looks very lamely familiar. I think they're trying to tell us something. <gasps> Is it supposed to be Gluteus Crouch? <laughs> What are they saying now? He says anyone who escapes from the House of Horror habitat never stays free for long. He also says, hold on to your lunches. I don't get that part. <gasps> oh, beast worst. I bet it would probably taste great with mustard. This is no time to eat. We are on a mission here. Hey, where'd the moles go? <laughs> So delicious. Tastes kind of moly. 
No, oh, I think we know where the moles went. Mm -hmm. Poor, delicious, mutant moles. Oh, I said this is no time to eat. Campbell Habitat escapees detected in restricted food prep area. Release monster protection protocol. Ah! Trapped again? This is both of your faults. Uh, technically, it's Squirt Stomach's fault. I did not actually eat the beast worst. Look, I can't help it if I eat when I'm nervous. <laughs> Squirt, wait! wait! Oh, see, see what, what you, you did? did? <clears throat> Come on. <laughs> Squirt, please wait. I'm sorry. The only way we'll get out of here is by working together. Oh. My stomach hurts. Oh, I shouldn't have eaten so many mole cookies. <laughs> Whoa, easy on the fork, quick, Squirt. Yeah, I'm better off alone. <laughs> Way to go, Mick, your fault. Mick, uh, my fault? <clears throat> yes, totally. Uh, Mick, your fault. Ow. No way. I'm not the one with the ultimate Mick fart quick power over here. All right. Like you've never farted. <laughs> I never said that, Little Miss Cheddar Shredder. You made me do it, Mick. Your fault. <gasps> Can we stop blaming each other for a moment? And huh? What does this do? Oh, evil scheme overlord mega control chair. Yes, <gasps> with exclusive back massage option. Oh. Okay, focus. We gotta find Squirt and figure out a way to stop Udius Crouch. Remember? I can't help it. I'm really good at pushing buttons. <gasps> Play kick and gloomy! Last one in is a rat! Oh, fell for the old mega maniacal man cave big screen TV. Do you know what this means? This has got to be the main control room to this place. You're right, Gretch. One of these cameras have got to be a live feed to show us where Squirt went and maybe find Gluteus. Where is he? And who is he? Of course! Tracks, the money, the lame dancing, even the name. Crouch is another word for squat. Gluteus is a fancy way of saying bottom smellers. Dun dun dun. But squat. So you figured it out, huh? Well, what gave me away? The high tech genius of my terrifying house of horrors. Let's see. Well, between all the obvious clues, I'd say it would definitely be the lame dancing that gave you away the most. Never mind that. What have you done with our counselors? I'm glad you asked. <laughs> <laughs> now, my mind-controlled house of horror slaves, get those bottom smellers! No! Not them! You're not going to ruin my house of horrors, bottom smellers. Not after I created a whole new identity and had cards printed. <laughs> <gasps> Failure to obey will not be tolerated. Ah! Sawyer, snap out of it! <laughs> oh, Sawyer! I'm so, so sorry! Why? I'm gonna make millions on this haunted house! Well, more millions. <laughs> Kids everywhere are gonna want to see the scariest, most pee in your pantsiest house of horrors ever. McGee, a little help <laughs> on it. <laughs> Good job on the button pushing. Thanks. Now let's find Squirt. <laughs> Squirt, you're back. All right. Good to see you, pal. Hey guys, what did I miss? I'll tell you what you won't want to miss: the house of horrors grand finale. <laughs> Disgusting on so many levels. But Squad, wait. I've seen you do some really creepy things this summer, but this is too creepy for even you. Please, please just let us go. Sorry, McGee, but I just can't not use a remote control that I paid for. 
You understand? Ah! Cream of washroom soup! This is the number one worst predicament I have ever been in. I can't keep up! Ah! Come on, Squirt! You can do it! Run like you did in the Rhino Chicken race! Right! Here goes! Yes! Run, Rhino Chicken! Run! Ah! Woohoo! I'm number one! Squirt, wait! We gotta stay together! Together? Great idea! Incoming! <laughs> guys! Guys! No! No! I don't want to be a number one! Ah! No! Guys! Oh! <laughs> Alone? My friends are flushed? Oh. Ah. I can't live in a world where just me and Butt Squad are the last one standing. That'd make us friends or something. Oh, what's the point of hanging on? Friends? Me and McGee? Friends? Squats. McGee, you saw right through me, buddy. All of my mean tricks, all my evil schemes were my way of saying how badly I wanted to be friends. No, 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 no. See, that's not what I meant. We're not friends, Butt Squad. We are not. Oh, oh good one, McGee. Let me try. <laughs> Hey! We can get out this way! Come on! Toot with me! <laughs> oh, McGee! I know we're gonna be the best toot buds! No, 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 no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, huh? Huh? The House of Horrors was just a horrible nightmare? And I'm not Butt Squatch's best bud? Oh, oh, everything is totally back to normal again. Oh, wow, well, squirt. Yeah, everything is oh, back to normal. Story. <laughs> How about a dead time story to scare them to sleep? That's crazy talk, mister! Then how come I just found the perfect book in the outhouse? Look! The boogeyman's back! <laughs> <laughs> what do you know? It worked! Don't you dare read to the end of this book or you'll free the boogeyman! <laughs> Seriously? Oh, yeah! That book used to scare the diapers off me! Hmm. I'd say it's about a zero on the scarometer. You can fly a balloon in the sky so blue, but the boogeyman will still get you. You can run to the lake and paddle a canoe, but the boogeyman will still get you. Hmm, didn't see that coming. I don't want to hear this! I'm not listening, I'm so not listening! La, 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 la. Gee, Gretchen, I wonder how this book ends. You're not supposed to read the end, or you'll free the boogeyman! Weren't you listening? He'll throw you in a pot and stir up a stew. The boogeyman will get you and all your friends, too. And the end. See? No boogeyman. Congrats, Squirt. You faced your fear head on. More like head down and under the covers, but close enough. You should have this, pal, because like I always say, Face your fear and your fear will disappear. <sighs> well, what I always say is, no more boogeyman, no way, no how! Just a sticky 
Freaky Hunt Squirt. But, uh, is that book still freaking you out? Me? Nah, I I'm totally... Ah! Ah! The book in the head! Ah! <laughs> Kabuki, man! <laughs> this is just last night's leftovers. Come on, Squirt. You gotta get over this. Yeah, bud. There's just no such thing as the boogeyman. I guess you're right. But if it's all the same to you, I'll just hide under here for a while. Well, don't hide too long. It's time for dance class. Let's boogie the boogeyman blew the way. <laughs> oh, jeez, that kid's got to get a hold of himself. He's built like a freight train, but he's afraid of the boogeyman. <laughs> the boogeyman! <laughs> Remember, Candles, dance expresses your innermost feelings. Whoa! What are you expressing, Squirt? I think you'd call it fear. Also anxiety, dread, and full-on terror. I don't know. I, we kind of freaked him out by reading the boogeyman's back last night. Relax, buddy. It's only a... Ah! The most terrifying children's book of all! <laughs> wow, that is hard to say with a straight face. Not helping, Armand. Come on, Squirt. If I weren't so terrified, I'd say... Wee! <laughs> well, I suppose dance class is cancelled. Time for chocolate slugs, huh? Sweet sluggy goodness. <laughs> Come to Papa. Um. <laughs> huh? Back in the closet with you? Oh, now where did I leave those sarsaparilla snake knees? <laughs> Squirt, you gonna let a kid's book stop you from swimming? Remember. Face your fear, and your fear will disappear. You're right, Gretchen. From now on, there is no boogeyman! Exactamundo. No! I threw the book out the door last night, and now it's gone! Ah! Somebody probably put it back in the outhouse, where it belongs. Then I'm not going to the bathroom for the rest of the summer! <laughs> Come on. A nice cold swim will help chill you out. Squirt! Squirt, you coming? In a sec. <laughs> hey, Squirt, what do you think of Sawyer's new digs? <laughs> Delightful accommodation. Yes, yeah, sir. A zombie's home is his castle. <laughs> and a tickly one at that. Let go of my toes, Scratch. <laughs> I'm not touching your toes, Sawyer. Well, if you ain't, then who is? <laughs> the Boogeyman! Sawyer! Hello, Gretchen. Read any good books lately? <laughs> Buddy, what's all the screaming? I can barely hear myself tumble. It's the bo 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 The boogeyman? For the last time, pal, there's no such thing as the boogeyman! Oh, man. This is a real I told you so moment, isn't it? Read it again! Ah! The story's all new, but one thing's the same. <laughs> Your friends are going in my stew. Don't worry, Squirt. I'll be back for you. <laughs> Any sign of Sawyer? Nope. But uh, no sign of the boogeyman either. Maybe he'll leave us alone. <laughs> you can fly in a balloon in the sky so blue. But the boogeyman will still get you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we read the book. <laughs> Let's bounce. Yeah. <laughs> yes, the new page. Now
Now let's row, row, row this boat. <laughs> you can fall in a lake and paddle in a canoe, but the boogeyman will still get you. Boogeyman! <laughs> No, 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 no! Ah! Oh, you'll never find us in here. You read the same book I did, right? You can hide in a closet or inside a shoe, but the boogeyman will still get you! Never liked this chapter. <laughs> oh, oh, my best buddies need me. I, I can do this. Face your fear and your fear will disappear. Scared or not? Here I come! <laughs> you can't escape! <laughs> You'll be my snack! Oh no, they won't! I've got their backs! Whoa! Nice plot twist, Squirt! I, I, I did it! <laughs> or maybe not. Squirt, come on! It's time to turn the page! <laughs> Smells like monster stew. <gasps> Hang on, guys! We're coming! Thanks, campers. The steam was playing havoc with my fur. Meh. But that boogeyman doesn't know from cooking. Mm, but you gotta love that zombie kick. <laughs> <laughs> You guys just had to read the end of that book, didn't you? Yeah, we were trying to get you to face your fear. <laughs> Stay back! <laughs> <laughs> Certainly not Squirt. He can't face his fear. <laughs> face your fear and your fear will disappear. Yo, Boogeyman! Yeah? Fall in that pot and we'll make you the stew! <laughs> That's not how the story goes! It is now. I rewrote the ending. Nice one, Squirt. by the boogeyman again. Yeah. Point seven. My turn! Watch your brother! <laughs> I think my spleen's feeling better. All right, Slimy, let's do that dive again! Uh, Slimy? He was here a second ago. Where could he be? <gasps> Wherever he is, I think he's in trouble! Look! Slimy stressing! <gasps> She couldn't have. She wouldn't have. She might have. <gasps> Come on, guys. We gotta stop Rosebud before she cooks slimy. Hi, Gurdurdos. Oh, you 
gotta try this mutant squid ink decongestant. Ugh. Oh. Oh. Guys, let's ignore that Rosebud's nasal runoff is draining into Lake Icky Gloomy for now. And be happy that she isn't cooking slimy. Cooking slimy? Cuddiddles. What kind of an animal do you take me for? 1001 recipes for mouth-watering, extra tender, Sasquatch barbecue. Hey, it always pays to be prepared. This moisturizer rosebud got me is absolutely sublime. And it smells like mesquite. Oops. Mustn't forget to moisturize the tenderloin area. Well, wherever Slimy is, at least we know he isn't going to be lunch. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> No. Slimy, is that you? You look scrumptious. That is ultra-high-grade, almost-extinct, super-delicious octopus. I source all my endangered butt-grade sushi myself in the underbutt. <gasps> Hang on, little sushi. We'll save ya. Not that underbutt. That one. Submarine, of course. That's how we'll find Slimy. Let's go, guys. Ah! <laughs> Slimy, huh? Sounds interesting. <laughs> okay, keep your eyes open for Slimy. Giant rock, dead ahead. <laughs> Both alarm. Just a turtle butt. A very ticked off turtle butt. Abandoned sub. No. <laughs> Slimy. <laughs> Who knew turtles like to play that? Slimy! We were so worried about you! What a relief to see that you're... <laughs> <laughs> Hanging out with other kids? <clears throat> Time for my triple backflip reverse skill twisting arm stand height dive! <laughs> Every time. Um, Slimy, all this time you have been hanging out with the bottom lurkers? McGee. Squirt, Gretch. Wow. <laughs> what are you guys doing here? Hey, Miguel. Uh, actually, we're here for Slimy. We were hanging out with him till he took off. Slimy? That's where you were when we texted you? But you said you were doing your taxes. I thought that sounded kind of fishy. What? Down here in Bottom Lake, fishy means totally believable. <gasps> it's true. Slimy's phone is full of bottom dweller selfies. <gasps> Why didn't you just tell us you were hanging out with them? Makes perfect sense. <gasps> what? You don't understand Slimy? <laughs> Are you kidding? Of course I do, Spout. You're Slimy. Just like you asked. <laughs> That's not what he said. Ow! That's what Slimy said. Ow! But I wish he didn't. Yeah. Anyway, we'll get out of here and take Slimy off. Sorry, McGee. But Slimy's staying. Hey, I get it. Slimy wants us to hang out together. <laughs> well, I guess we could share Slimy. Just as long as we don't have to share him with anyone else or anything else. Ah! It's anything else! <laughs> What? What? Slimy hangs out with that thing, too? Oh, he'd have never done anything like that back at Lake Bottom. He must have picked it up from you guys. Um, in case you didn't notice, Slimy doesn't belong on land. He's a water breather like us. So go find an air breather to hang out with. It's just not the same. We hung out with Slimy all summer. We know him way better than you do. 
As if we hung out with Slime Owl High Tide. We know him way better than you do. And way wetter, too. Not, Not now, now, Slimey. slimey. Hmm. Ultra high grade species so rare you can be the last of your kind left. Now that's what I call endangered delicious. <laughs> Oh, it's slimy stressing! Nothing to see here. Just capturing your delicious friend and making him into sushi. <gasps> Ew! Sushi ink! Stress ink! That's the ticket! Aha! <laughs> uh -huh, we did it! Now quick! Everybody swim! Swim for your lives! Wasn't a cave? <gasps> Even with all this water, I still need to take a long shower. <laughs> a lobster trap? How humiliating! Go! Don't worry about us, McGee! Just get slimed into safety! Hurry! <laughs> Do your worst, butt squad! You'll never get to eat slimy! Never! You may not be sushi quality, but you'll do for a midday snack. No! Slimy! Don't do it! <laughs> the old pretend to turn the mutant fish kids into sushi trick always works. Come here, look! <laughs> Slimy! No! After this, my list of ultra-rare lunch items will be complete. And I never thought I'd top white rhino horn pate or squeaky clean squid bowel. Squeaky clean? Squeaky! <gasps> That's it! Squeaky! I got it! McGee, now is the worst possible time for a game of slime and sea. <laughs> Get ready, guys! If I know my squeaky toys, that insanely horrifying monster should be here any second. <laughs> Okay, any second. Here we go. Any second now. Sure, I can do this way faster, but I just love the drama. We need more time. We need to distract Butt Squad. We need to... Time for my triple backflip, reverse blade twisting arm stand high dive. Yeah! <laughs> If we learned anything, it's that one weird mutant sea creature should be enough to go around for all of us. We're all really glad you didn't become an exotic lunch item. He says he loves us all and wants us to share him. Uh-huh. <laughs> <sighs> Last week of camp, oh 
mount fit to blow. I'll miss you, searing hot, molten lava! Last week of camp! <laughs> I'll miss you guys most of all. Aw, squirt. I'll miss you too, buddy. But pull yourself together. You know I can't stand all that mushy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's the last week of camp, but don't get all gloomy and doomy. There's always next summer and the summer 300 years from now. <gasps> right. I always forget how short your human lifespans can be. Cheer up. Just because you're going to die eventually doesn't mean we can't have plenty of fun before the farewell bonfire at the end of the week. Oh. <laughs> oh. Holy zombie guacamole! It says here that we're getting two new campers for the last week of camp? What? Noobs? No way! Not for the last week of camp. That's the most emotional week of camp there is. There will be ugly crying. Lots of it. And how can we concentrate on the new campers when our minds are already on the post-camp vacay? <laughs> Relax, guys. We can lend a hand. Us campers know the lake bottom ins and outs so well. I mean, we're practically staff, and I... <gasps> Sawyer, that's it! You make us staff in training. All right, campers. Um, I mean, staff in training. You got a deal. Yeah! First staff in training lesson. The art of camper debushing. I remember my first bus trip. It's when me and Barfy became best buds. Hey, buddy. Time is home. I have the witch in here. I don't like the smell of Sasquatch fur. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> Get that bratty camper off that bus step. Hmm, <laughs> a new record. The key to camper cooking is knowing the perfect spice to add just by sniffing. <laughs> you know, I was just going to add some salt, but that might give the stew some nice earth tones. Nice work, Cadidus. Hey, Sawyer, I think I'm getting the hang of this caretaker thing. Nice work, Gretch. But can I have my arm back now? Kind of need it. Especially the plunger attachment. Oh, I can't believe this is our fifth to last lunch. Oh, I'm gonna miss this. I... Oh! 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 You know what I mean. McGee's right. I'm going to miss everything we've done this summer. Oh, I'm going to miss it. Terribly. Oh, so many memories. Huh? Ew, this place stinks. I would know. That bus ride from Sunny Smiles made me motion sick. No way. <laughs> Our new Lake Bottom campers are Sunny Smilers? Welcome to Lake Bottom. Cancel that help request. Ah! Oh, easy, guys. Stop. Stay back. This is Pud Squad approved bottom smeller repellent. Keep away, bottom smellers. This message is approved by Bud Squad. You know the repellent isn't repellent. Uh, rep uh, uh, it's not making things go away. Okay, let's try this welcome to Camp Lake Bottom again. I'm McGee, this is Gretchen, and the monsters you see behind you are our counselors. The name's Sawyer. Welcome to Lake Bottom. Uh, 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 and I'm, I'm Portnoy. <laughs> ah! Don't worry, happens all the time. I am Armand. I dabble a bit in hairstyling. You must tell me how you get such wonderful curls. Thanks, it's a patented line of family products. I'm Sasha Smithywicks. Smithywicks? The same makers of Beaver Delectable Hair Products? Yes, of course. I use them all the time. Oh, so luxurious. Someone noticed. Let me get this straight. 
The diva of diva delectable got kicked out of snooty sunny smiles? Yeah, well, it was kind of my fault. Uh, I got kicked out for not having my own platinum credit card. <laughs> Oh, and I got yeah. kicked out for not making fun of him for not having his own platinum credit card loud enough. So Butt Squad dumped us both here. Hmm. How are we supposed to believe anything Sunny Smilers say? I'll, uh, I'll prove it. Gold card, silver card, diamond card. No platinum card. I guess it all checks out. Anyway, we're here to make your lake bottom experience the most awesome experience of your lives! And more than just nuclear farts and exploding zombies, you know. Woo! Ah! Um, you know, most days. Now, as your very own lake bottom staff in training, we're here to show you the ropes. See? Easy peasy. Okay. Uh, is this how you hold the ropes? Portnoy, those aren't the ropes. Those are the mutant maggots. Ah! 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 Oh, how I miss the screams of discovering your first mutant maggot. Ooh, and the smell of that new pee in your pants, fear. I know this goes against our staff and training training, McGee. Who cares if they ever get the hang of Lake Bottom? Camp's already almost over. Come on, Gretch. Sure, they still have that sunny smiler non-stank on them. But give the noobs a chance, all right? Fine. All right, noobs. Lake Bottom is full of dangers, and a bottom dweller always needs to be prepared. You never know when a bear verine may pounce. Uh, I'll never be able to do that. Based on this martial arts website, anyone could do it if they start slow enough. See? Okay, let's see. Rising sun crow snatches the fly. Ah, uh, well, it's a start. Mm, nothing like a lake bottom lunch. Phew, Butt Squad was wrong about the disgusting stuff bottom smellers eat. This looks like actual pasta. Yeah, I, I only eat because of my biological need for sustenance. You see, with my perpetual sinus condition, I haven't got a sense of smell or sense of taste for that matter. You definitely have no sense of taste. That shirt is dreadful. So, you kidlets like my special vermaggetti? So wriggly in the tummy, yes? <laughs> I remember freeing my first belly worms. <laughs> the last bonfire of the summer. You know, something special always happens at the last bonfire of the summer. Ah, uh, Sorry, McGee. So, what were you babbling about? Ah, so romantic. And then, Buford Lake Bottom built his very own camp atop a haunted Ooh. cemetery. Over the centuries, bottom dwellers had to defend the camp from Butt Squat's ancestors. A special contest was created to pick the skills of those who wanted to take Lake Bottom against those who belong at Lake Bottom. The Camp Lake Bottom Classic was born! Oh, 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 wow. Its challenging events rely on pure Lake Bottom know-how. Don't worry, you'll never... Uh, uh, and... Yeah, nice one, Sawyer, the old disappearing zombie caretaker bit. Okay. Whoa. Ah! You have 30 seconds to vacate my property. <laughs> so many memories gone. Oh, God. <laughs> Take over Camp Lake Bottom? Easy with this. The Camp Lake Bottom deed. How did you get that? My genius scheming, obviously. That and nobody was looking when I took it. Well, it'll take more than a moldy old deed to stop us. Armand, sick. <laughs> Unhead my butt dozer, or the zombie caretaker gets spritzed. He means it, campers. Sawyer? According to my uh, internet search, uh, Sawyer's essence is actually part of Camp Lake Bottom, which means it legally belongs to uh, uh, Butt Squat, too. Now get off my property! Huh? Campers! You can get the camp back! Defeat Butt Squat at the Camp Lake Bottom Classic! Oh!